So hey, I'm Oren, and that's the brand new Ubuntu tablet. We launched it last week. Uh, we think it's an amazing tablet OS, probably the best out there at the moment. And it's for a couple of reasons. For, for, for start, we killed the button. There are no buttons this experience. It's all gesture-based. You can use the edges to navigate between different screens of the application. Um, and then if you see here, it's multi-user. You can see I can changing like different screens between users. Each one of them has its own background, its own personalization. Um, this is extremely useful for enterprises and it's critical for enterprises. It's highly secure and encrypted. Let me show you something about the edges that I mentioned before. So I'm going to use the guest account for that. The right edge brings me back to my application. So swiping from the right edge, I can dismiss the welcome screen. From the left edge, I get this nice application launcher. So I don't need to go anywhere to launch an application. Just do it directly from wherever I am. So if I want to launch an application or go to the home screen, I can just swipe right in, keep my finger on the, on the launcher, and then release on it to go to an application. Bam, I'm in my gallery application. This is our, one of our native applications. It's beautiful, responsive. An interesting thing is that I can use the top edge to access my system. I don't need to go from an application anywhere. My system is just up here, right? I have my time and date. If I want to change brightness or log into a network, I just do this, change the, the brightness, go right out. Here are my messages. I can actually dismiss them. I can access to my, net my messages and I can answer them directly from the messaging menu. Close that, and then how do we multitask, right? So one of the key things about the Ubuntu tablet is that it has this fast and fluid multitasking, and it's all enabled through the edges. So I, remember, this is the launcher, I can do launch any application from here, but if I swipe all the way to the left, I'm in my home screen, in the app screen, and I can actually have here all my installed applications and other available for download applications, so I can just download directly from the home screen. I don't need to go anywhere. Going back to my application, but let's do that again and see what, what are the other options. I can actually go back to my application by just swiping from the right, just like that. Swiping, just swiping through the right edge and I'm back in my application. So home screen and app, super cool. Now I want to show one, one, one cool feature about the tablet, which is running two applications side by side. Let's run a telephony application. Just want to make a call, I want to be on, on gallery, watching some photos, maybe I want to send them to somebody. I can actually pop, fire up another application, I can do stuff between those applications, I can do it together. So let's, let's shoot the browser for example. Let's go to our own home screen. This is our home screen, and I can actually put in the notepad application on the side here. And I can actually copy stuff from the web browser to the note application. I can do that without switching application. That's the beauty of it, because switching with your eyes, that's the fastest way to switch. Let's, let's, let's give a little demo of that. Copy, and I fire up, I open a new note, long press and paste, and there you go. That's right, awesome phone. This is our phone. There you go, working with two applications, putting them side by side, really make them, uh, you, make, you can actually work with them together. So, this thing, the side stage we call it, allows you to run phone application, and you can actually switch between application on the side stage, just through the right edge. Everything is optimized for your thumbs. I can do everything from my thumbs, bring it in, bring it out, get my settings, everything is available for the thumbs. One last cool thing, let's go back to gallery. Let's say you want to do some image manipulation. Tablets are really limited in that. They often have like these toolbars or whatever and you can have five, six, and 10 features available on a tablet. If you want to put like something like Photoshop on this device, it's going to be extremely complicated. You're going to get like unusable uh, interface. We invented something called the HUD and that allows you to put Photoshop application on the tablet. Let me show you how. Just launch the HUD. It's a search-based interface that retrieves features when you need them. When you don't need them, the interface is completely clean. You don't see anything, it's just a photo. When I need a command, I just shoot the HUD, I fire up the HUD, you can just search for the command. Let's say I want to go crop. Here's the crop command. And shabam, I launched the crop command. I can now crop the, crop the image. And there you go. Let's, let's try it again on another command. Let's say I want to change the color. It's right here, color. 
balance. Color balance. And so, but there, but Let's then, add some saturation. Let's increase the contrast a bit. And maybe tweak the U. Get it a bit more purpley tone, and there you go. I edited an image. My beauty of the HUD is that you can do that on a phone as well. The same interface would work on a phone as well. Here's the Ubuntu phone. Let's do the same thing on the Ubuntu phone. Using the right edge, I can switch, and the left edge, I can switch to any application. Let's fire up the gallery. Here's the photo. I want to edit. Let's fire up the HUD. Let's write crop. There you go, the crop interface. And there I can actually crop that image just right here down on the phone. Crop. And I'm done. Let's do it again for color balance. Color balance, there you go. Adding saturation, a bit of contrast, changing a bit the U, confirm, and we got a new image. Uh, application crashed, but that's 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 the main vision of Ubuntu. Here's the image here. Same image. Three two application. Using the HUD, I can run Photoshop on a phone and a tablet. And basically, this is the vision of Ubuntu. We're going into a world where one device with one stack of code will run everything you do, provide you everything you need from personal computing. Uh, we call this Unity, actually. This is the concept of Ubuntu, that interface we have here. It's called Unity. Uh, and the Unity interface of Ubuntu is actually going to allow you to run the phone, the tablet, and the desktop for maybe one device. You can have your phone hooked into a big screen, and that becomes a desktop. You can have your tablet added with a keyboard and a mouse, and that becomes a nice little laptop where you can do stuff. But you can also do it on the uh, just on the uh, just on the uh, touch interface through the HUD. And when will this be available to buy? So it's out there actually. It's released as code. We are uh, uh, working on the open, so our code is out there. Uh, you can just go to developer.ubuntu.com, download the cloud, and flash any old Nexus device: Galaxy Nexus, Nexus 4, Nexus 7, and Nexus 10, and you'll get those beautiful interface running. It's limited, it's a developer preview, but we believe that code release will be somewhere down the end of this year and devices coming to market sometime first queue next, uh, next year. Cool, thank you.